Fries up, fries up. I never really done point of view cooking like this, but I thought I'd try. How are you guys doing? Oh. What, what are you doing, James? Huh? What are you doing? Cooking. Oh, wow. Baking. You're gonna bake? Okay, I was gonna make soup, but I guess I. You wanna make soup? Go ahead. You're, you're in that area. I don't wanna. You know, I don't wanna bother you. You're working in that area. I'm just mixing this for now. You can still make soup if you want to. So, let me go get some of the um, ingredients. I gotta get some of the ingredients, you guys. We gotta get some uh, almond flour. I baked with almond flour. This is one of the keto flour. And I also use... Grasp it away. Protein isolate. That's good stuff. If you want me to mix it on this side, I can mix it on this side. Whatever side you are not using. Super boy, get out of the kitchen. The Alright, so how are you guys doing? So, 
That's um. Superboy, get up. Fido, get up. So we gotta start with the flower. Because we always start with the flower. We're making the. Uh, Making some keto blondie um we're making keto blondie um brownies huh as long as i'm not in your way you're making lunch, I don't want to be in your way. We'll do it this way. Okay, so we're going to start with, uh, you always start with flour. Get the uh, get the measuring cups here. I got measuring cups up here. Oh, see my measuring cup. I got some measuring cups. So how we do this is we start with flour. I asked for a full cup of flour, but I'm not using a full cup. A flour. I'm mixing half a cup of flour with half a cup of uh, grass-fed whey. Oops, just go down. Just, just so I can cut the carbs. Because we are doing keto baking. Let me go get the whey. I think this is a better point of view for cooking, right? At least to me it is. So this is what we got so far. One cup total. Superboy, get out. Get. So what I do is I, I don't really have a sifter thing, so I just use a, a spatula and just do it like this. Some people have like a sifter thing. But I don't have a sister. So what I'm using is a is a um a strainer. 
like a fine mesh strainer to sift, quote unquote, sift the uh, the flour. I like to put all the dry ingredients together and then mix the white ingredients together later. I guess technically we can just pour this in without sifting it. We'll just pour it in without sifting it. It doesn't take too long to sift this way. It's easier, much easier if you have a sifter, but I don't have a sifter with me in it. So I just mix all the dry ingredients. This is one cup of flour, you guys. Or the equivalent of one cup of flour. Um, what else is that? Oh, also, we're using, they asked for vanilla flavored, but this is, um, I think this is chocolate flavored. You can see that creamy chocolate fudge. They asked for vanilla flavored, but it's creamy chocolate fudge. Two, two scoops of this. Doesn't matter because we are making chocolate flavored. Chocolate brownies. Mix all this together. Put that to mix that together. He says the Hittites likely made clever use of these blistering wounds. Evidence of iron production remains a mystery of the Snow of Mountain. Um, look at the recipe some more. Uh, sugar, baking soda, and sugar, baking soda. Okay, I got it. Sugar, baking soda. Okay, sugar and baking soda. Okay. So I got some baking soda. That's for one teaspoon. Remember when you're baking to always uh, make it as precise as possible. Uh, teaspoon. This is half a teaspoon. This is one tea half a tablespoon. I used a half teaspoon. Use two halves, goes one whole, right? <laughs> what you do is you oh. one teaspoon. Just one teaspoon. Oh, you do this right. It asks for a half a cup of sweetener, but I usually use a quarter cup because a half cup is a lot of sweetener. Unless you guys want it super sweet like that. But myself, I do not like it super sweet like that. 
so, but I use a sweetener called allulose. You can use like something like monk fruit or something like that if you have it. Like a Lakanto or stevia, but I'm using allulose. Where's a quarter? I have a quarter right here. And it's, and it's just fine for what we do. It is perfectly fine. Oops. If you want it sweeter, you can always add more. For me, I don't like I don't like it super sweet. It's it's okay. That's pretty much all the dry ingredients. Next step. Um. Yeah, that's all the dry ingredients. So next, I'm gonna mix the wet ingredients together. I do. Oh. I do have a thing for the window. So um Let's mix all the white ingredients together. They asked for two eggs. I got two eggs here. Don't put that away. Some people can crack eggs with one hand, but I can't. Mix all the wet ingredients together. So, um, okay. Got some butter. Oh, we have, you bought one bar of unsalted? No, it was, uh, we have one bar left over. I didn't find one. Oh, you found it. One cup of the ounces, so a third would be when they are talking about five tablespoons, five tablespoons, what were you saying? What were you talking about? Never mind, never mind. The metal was still being developed in amazing weaponry, but it was 
was also creating new opportunities for humankind. Mm -hmm. Always use unsalted, you guys. Um, I have a knife here. Always use unsalted if you can. I gotta melt that in. Anyway, so how are you guys doing? Get this over here. So I can open the, uh, microwaves. We're doing some keto baking right now. Hey there. Hi Sonic, how you doing? We're doing some keto baking right now. If you wanna know how to make uh, keto brownies, we're making keto brownies today. Keto. Making it the best I could make it. So how you doing, man? Hey, super boy. I'm melting butter in the microwave right now. So we got some melted butter, unsalted butter. So we pour this in here. Put this in here. I have a mixer that I use to mix the the white ingredients. I just mix it together for a little bit. Before we add more of the white ingredients. Five tablespoons. Oops. Should be good. I've done this before, but just mixing all this together. I have done it before. Um I use powdered peanut butter, which is okay. I asked for regular peanut butter, but since I have powdered peanut butter, I figure why not eat it. One, 
two, three, four, five. Now you mix it with water. I know you guys have heard of powdered peanut butter before. It's great for baking. So now I got some water. Hey, Superboy. Let me get some water. Yeah, powdered peanut butter is good for baking. Let me just get a cup. So, and better fry tablespoons of water. Measure five tablespoons of water. One, two, three, four, five. Turns out okay. And now let's uh, mix it together. Super boy, get. Get out of the kitchen, Superboy. Let me get a smaller spoon and mix it together. If you want it thinner, you can always make it thinner. If this is too thick for you, you can always make it thinner. See, it's beginning to look like regular peanut butter already. Try adding one more tablespoon of water. Why not? You don't want it super runny, but you don't want it super thick either. It's not bad. You don't want it like watery, I mean. Actually, this is not bad, peanut butter. Okay. So I will mix this in here. This is where all the wet ingredients goes into. this together mix this together this is all good Of the 
Um, let's see, where's the, where's the chocolate? I think I have the chocolate over there. Let me go find the chocolate. Where's the chocolate? Let's see if I can find the chocolate here somewhere. It asks to melt a chocolate bar, which I'm not going to do. I have the chocolate nowhere. Yeah. Huh? Yeah, the chocolate. Oh. You have the chocolate, Emily? Is where? It's up, up there. Oh, you can put it in here? Oh, it is in here. Okay. Hey there. Don't complain about the ads, man. The more ads you watch, the more money I make. Anyways, we're, ma we're making some uh, food. Chocolate, so three ounces of chocolate. Three ounces is how many tablespoons? Three times two, six tablespoons. Anyways, how you doing? over here <laughs> that's what happens when you cook sometimes you make somewhat of a mess but it's okay three I need three more Superboy, get out of the kitchen, Superboy. Get out of the kitchen, Superboy. Anyways, how you guys doing? You guys want some peanut chocolate peanut butter blondie? Need 
Tony. 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 I use um, a mix of coconut oil and MCT oil to make my own chocolate, which is good. Healthier for you, anyways. Oh. One. Two. Then melt them regular coconut oil. Um, mix this together. Or five. We can melt all this together, don't worry guys. Six. It might look a little bit oily right now, but don't worry, it'll be okay. This is all going to be melted together. Keto baking. Okay. All good. What you do, you put this in the microwave a little bit to melt the, uh, the coconut oil. And then you mix it together. 30 seconds for now. Thank you. 
If I need to do it a little bit more than 30 seconds, that'd be fine. Should be fine though. Can be okay. Thirty, I think thirty seconds should be okay. Let me get this spoon. See if I can mix it together. Can melt it together. Actually, this didn't turn out too bad. The Dutch Dutch processed chocolate. So now what we do is we mix it all together in here. Depending on how chocolatey you want it. You might want it more chocolatey than it is, but it might also be fine with you. Because this is fine with me. Oop. You can mix this all together. How chocolatey do you guys like it? Mix it together and it becomes like a puff or whatever. It's all mixed together. <coughs> Anyways, let's see uh, what, the, what the battery life is. Well, 75, 70%, 70 that's not too bad. So mix it all together. So we mix this all together. This is the chocolate concoction. And then now, what we do? Was we mix this with my previously mixed white? How many dry ingredients? Mix all this together with the dry ingredients. So, we mix all this together.
I don't want to drop this thing in here. So I'll hold it by this side. If I get some on my fingers, it's okay. You can always wipe it off. But I think this is good. Oh! Superboy? No? Superboy, get, 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 get out, get out, get out, get out, go, get out. A dog's not supposed to be in the kitchen. So now that we poured that in, now let's mix all this together. It will be a little bit thick, but it's supposed to be a little bit thick. Mm -hmm. Not supposed to be. The River marks the and it's supposed to be thick, I guess. Not supposed to be runny. You know, I add nuts and stuff to this so you want to do. It's supposed to be a little bit thick like this. You can see it is thick, but this is how it's supposed to be. Super boy, I told you to get out of here. Fido! Fido! Why does my dog? Anyways, let's um, let's see if I can uh, get all this out of here. Not too bad. Not entirely bad. Does that look good to you guys? You guys like chocolate brownies? These are keto chocolate brownies. Chocolate peanut butter brownies, actually. You can always add nuts in it if you want to. But you don't have to. I should have, uh, let's preheat the oven at 325. Let's see, make sure there's nothing in here. There's always stuff in the oven. Get this out. That's one thing you gotta do. Remember to check the oven to see if there's anything in here. Cause you don't wanna preheat the oven when there's stuff in there. Let's start. <coughs> Cause you don't wanna quote unquote melt anything that's already in there. Okay. Um. Mom, what? which one should we use? For what? 
Or the brownie. You want to, like last time, you want a tray? They're rooting out I guess we can use the glass one. Yeah. Is it on top? I don't think so. It's, I don't see it. No? Um, the Reapers are a paradise for all the Did you put it, put it back in the other side? Other place? You guys can see this. A large bird rides the wind above the rustling reeds. I can always uh, crush some macadamia nuts. It's an eastern bird. Oh, it's a wingspan more than a meter wide. Mix that inside. Let me get that guy. Is Dad having some? Oh, you found it? You want me to crush some nuts and see? Yeah, why don't you put some nuts in there? You don't have to crush it that much. Just, you know, roughly chop, right? You don't have to crush. It's just roughly chop. What kind of nuts do you want? I don't want it, though. Here, I'll go get it. You want it? Go get some wanna. Okay. We can probably mix it in here. Kind of like a blob. Kind of. It's supposed to be thick like this, though. This one, too, watches the Harrier intently. So, anyways, how you guys doing? We're making... Hey, Epic, haven't seen you in a while. We're making some uh, chocolate, some keto chocolate brownies right now. My mom's getting some walnuts that we can mix inside. Oh, let me... Uh, Put that out of the way. There we go. Here. Okay. I'm gonna finally chop. I'm gonna chop some water. So we're gonna put water in here. Put like a couple of handfuls. So how you doing, Epic? Yeah, I think that's plenty. Where's the clip? And get a knife. This funny too much. That's good, roughly chopped. That's good, isn't it? Yeah. Are you gonna mix it inside or what? I'm gonna mix like half inside and then oh, half out. What if you mix the whole thing inside? You wanna mix the whole thing together? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Yeah, 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 Okay, take care, Epic. Have a good night.
don't want you to stay up if you're too tired. Mix this together in here. The Harrier threatens the ducks with an aerial attack. Battles between Harriers and ducks continue. So what to do? So I mix the it nuts in here. On the lower reaches of the Tony River, teeming with hardy birds and other creatures, the waterside provides a rich sanctuary. So what you do is you spray it. I think we got the spray here somewhere. Yep, you spray it. See, I have uh, avocado spray. Shake it first. Before you spray it. Shake it first. You always shake it first. And then you spray it with avocado spray. So. Spray it over the sink so that it doesn't... Go all over the place somewhere else. So now you pour this in here. And then you take the spatula and you thread it out. I didn't put a layer on top, and that's okay. Spread it out as much as you can. And then you wait to start. Hey, Superboy! Get! Superboy! Fido! Outside, boy! Go! Fido, get out. Go. Well, now that we're we're waiting for the uh, for the oven to preheat, let me put some of this away. Hey, go, go. Drink some soup, Dad. Drink some soup, Dad. Fido, get out of the kitchen. I told you plenty of times. Get out of the kitchen. Okay, so. Um, what's this in the sink? I'll wash this later. Everything okay? Hey, hey, Jace, you need to super soak. boy get out. Jace, yeah, you need to soak everything before it gets dry because if you don't soak it, it's gonna mm -hmm. like you wash. Everything's gotta be soaked, all right? Okay, I guess we can, I can yeah. soak it with soapy water or something. Yeah, um, yeah, I'm still, I'm still trying to water on. I'm gonna use this water to soak. Okay. It. You want me to use the water? No. Oh. Because I'm going to use the water from here to soak. Okay, is it three? Oh, it's ready? Yeah. This is ready. Can put this in here? Be careful, you guys. You never want to burn yourself. And then... 
cook time. 20 minutes. Start. Good thing about our new oven is that it has a timer that turns itself off. Oh, it does? After you set the cooking time. That way you can't overcook something. <laughs> like you leave it in the oven and you forget about it and you have a burnt chicken. You can't do that with it. Because it has a self timer. Oh, that's good. Good to know. I didn't know that. Now it's time to wash the dishes. Wait, what's on? Oh, okay. Well, you want to wash it now. It's okay. It's so good to get dry. Today, get to know a man you're familiar with. And so, while I was baking, we were washing the dishes. This perhaps is the most famous print by the artist Chunuk, who produced more than 140 prints. You should use this because this has, okay, that's, I mean, you know, use this. This is the better scrub. Do you want to? It's up to you. He wears a striped kimono. The kind favored by commoners. He's gone with a casual streak over the shoulders. And his hair is grown out and unkempt. Rather than You're making chicken for dinner? That was yep. the norm of the time. Perhaps he's a thief or a masterless samurai. So while I am waiting for the narrow, he seems like a bit of a bad boy. A desperado. While the uh the brownies are baking. I am making. I am cleaning the dishes. Not making anything. I'm cleaning the dishes. You can always serve the brownies that you want to with like a chocolate ganache on top. Some people like that. Well, not really. For me, I'm not really a chocolate ganache type person. But some people like that. This go like that. It's up to you though, on whether you're a chocolate ganache type person. But personally, I am not. Some what? Well, he's burning some in a fireplace. It smells like plastics burning. Are you burning plastic? Why are you burning anything? We told you like 500 times not to burn anything. My dad doesn't understand that. Whenever he turned the fireplace on, we get a backdraft in the house. We can smell. There we go. Fido, get out of the kitchen. Fido! Get out of the kitchen. Fido! I don't know how thick it is. Maybe 
had become a fan of Ramiji after seeing him perform that day. Everybody's been washing the dishes, you guys. We are waiting for the brownies to bake. It only takes about 20 minutes to bake the brownies. At 3.50. After we wash the dishes, I'm going to get myself a boat of stuff to eat. A bowl of soup to drink. I don't know why some people call it eating soup, but technically you don't chunk down with your teeth. <laughs> Unless the soup had stuff in it. I think we could see Hunter and that you could technically eat. It's most it's mostly drinking your soup. Because most soup has a watery texture to it. Giants gave me some. Fido, get out, Fido, get out. Move this out of the way. Move this in here. Oh. Okay. We are waiting for brownies to bake. While we are waiting for our brownies to bake, I'll grab myself a bowl of soup. My mom made some wonderful soup for us today. Some Daofu and Sayong Choi. In case you guys don't know, Sayong Choi is watercress. Home run? Foul. Hey, Vido. The sale try is watercress. In Cantonese, another foul ball. It's a national game. Theater One LA or New York. Or New York. He got a base hit. You can tell that a lot of times the national announcers are so biased against Bay Area teams. I don't know why. Anyways, we're getting some soup, you guys. Second 
Trey Turner. Got about 10 minutes before the brownies are done. Got some soup, you guys. You guys want to see me eat some soup? I don't know what you guys do or not. They go from in the 107 win season being great defensively to in the two or three worst teams in baseball. Right, and you talk about what that does collectively. It takes us off. Not in time. Put this here. What's good about the, the thing about this is that I can think about this neck thing. So how are you guys doing? Eating some soup. Or drinking soup rather. While we're waiting. Woody so far, his first three hitters. 0-2 on all three. Halfway there on Smith. While we're waiting for the brownies to... Uh, Should have been Get made. That view with you, with you. It's a zone stand. Just by turning around. Probably the half minute. Okay, you know what? I don't know. She's all yours. 
Get some tacos? No, I'm not really in the mood. Yeah, you're right. It's so messy. I don't even have cans. There's different toppings. Actually, I don't have Yeah, yeah. The UPS boat can help your small business with more ease than you realize. So how are you guys doing? Smells good. I wish you guys could smell it in here. It smells so good. Smells so good. You guys know the smell of the uh, chocolate brownies? It smells so good in here right now. I personally love the smell of chocolate brownies. So how's everybody doing? Oh, that's why they have Bell playing VA. Can you share what we saw? No, absolutely. Belt is the VA, not the uh, first baseman because of his knee problem. But they need his defense, though. Fido! Let me go get my dog. Fido! There's about two hours and fifteen minutes before she got it. And again, if you happen to just tune in, there was a conversation yesterday. The Dodgers didn't like the Antoine Richardson first base coach was finally up the line by the box, thought that he was trying to steal signs from the relay science to the hitter. And that's the you guy like <laughs> first base coach's box. And that was the sign of the game. Well, that is part of the game. But let me know if you have to, uh, if you think you see it, let it go. About 40 seconds, man. You guys want to see the games that I'm playing right now? 
I'll show you guys the game I'm playing right now. What? Oh, the timer went off. You know what you need to do? Um, like the toothpick, yeah. Yeah. Because you got, you know, you can't leave it in the oven if it's done. It's still continue to bake. I know. For at least five minutes. Okay, let me, let me go, um, I'll be right back, you guys, let me go check the brownies. Well, good, though. I'll show you guys. Hey. I'll show you guys what I made. Hey there, Benny. I'll show you guys what I made. Let me let me put this around. My brownies. You guys, Benny? <coughs> brownie, brownie, brownie. Does it look good to you? Okay, so. Stop pointing it out on my stream, man. I don't care. You always make a big deal about it. Yes, I, I put... I put walnuts in it. I'll wait till it cools down and then I'll cut it. You can see the nuts in it. 
It's not finely chopped. It's somewhat chopped, but not finely chopped. I probably could have chopped it better, but or chopped it more. But but it's okay. So I will show you guys what I'm playing. Can you guys see that? Showing you on my laptop. I don't know, is it kind of crooked? I do. <laughs> I do. They're keto brownies. They're not made with real sugar. They're keto brownies. Made with almond flour, not regular flour. I still I lost. Only thing I bake are keto. Have you had takoyaki before? I have a takoyaki maker. Taco in Japanese means, uh, um, no, taco in Japanese means, taco in Japanese means, um, octopus. I do have some octopus. That I bought a while ago that I never used, I never opened. But you could use, you could use, you could technically use anything you want. It doesn't have to be octopus. But traditionally it's made with octopus. I'm streaming from home using my streaming phone. <laughs> it says a streaming straight from my PC. <laughs> A new diet, which is what? Being a, being a semi-health guru that I am, I never believed in 
the notion that you can eat anything as long as you exercise it off. But that does not work. I don't believe in calories in, calories out. Because that makes people think they can eat anything as long as they work it off. Which is not true. But yes, people who work out more can eat more quote-unquote bad stuff. But it doesn't mean that a person who works out all the time can just load up on McDonald's. Because our body does not work like that. Are you consuming more grains? Is that what you're doing? Grains are a great source of fiber, by the way. They say the average person is supposed to consume anywhere from 35 to 40 grams of fiber a day. I don't know you want to watch me uh, play Raid Shadow Legends. Do you... Do you eat it plain or do you eat it with butter or peanut butter? So I saw this streamer the other day watching videos on how to make the quote-unquote perfect peanut butter sandwich. She was just watching random videos on how to make the perfect peanut butter sandwich. More precisely, peanut butter and jam. PB and J, peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Okay, so cheeses can be a good form of fat, depending on the kind of cheese, obviously. If you get your fat from nuts and cheeses instead of fat from animals and stuff, that's the healthy fat. Of course, if you're eating, if you get your fat from the grass-fed animals, that's different. So they sell lard made from 100% grass-fed animals, but it's probably super expensive. Anyways, I am playing Raid Shadow Legends. You guys can join Raid Shadow Legends by using hashtag Raid Game. Real cheese. Oh, that's cool. What kind of cheeses do you use? This is a PC stream without being on a PC, how about that? I know it's kind of different. Have you ever seen a PC stream without being on a PC? The reason why I'm using my phone instead of my computer right now is because I was showing baking. What kind of cheeses do you use? Like, some people like multiple cheeses. I'm not a big cheese sandwich guy. But 
A lot of people like multiple cheeses on their cheese sandwich. Protein. We need our protein. Protein helps us build muscle. The problem with a lot of vegetarians and vegans is that they don't consume enough protein. Or they don't get the nutrients that meat have that you can't simply get by just taking supplements. You know, stuff like collagen. Because there is no collagen in vegetables. You get collagen from cows. So a lot of vegetarians and vegans don't get collagen, enough collagen and protein. You could buy collagen, but it's still made from cows, like bone marrow and stuff, which comes from cow. But you still need to eat the meat to get the most out of it. Preferably pasture raised or grass fed. Besides, a lot of vegetarians and vegans I know, they love dessert. So just because you don't eat meat doesn't mean that you're super healthy. Why would you do that? You would get yourself in trouble, man. I know you wouldn't literally say that to people, but if you did, you could really get yourself in trouble. Especially if you say it to the wrong people. You don't want somebody to take it the wrong way and end up contributing to crime in the city. You gotta be careful on who you say stuff to. Oh! Did you... Did you hear about the case? My mom told me about it. In, um... In Whole Foods. Some lady went... Some lady went to take out her phone to look at her shopping list. And... Two people who were acting as innocent bystanders went and grabbed the phone and took it in the middle of Whole Foods at Stonestown. (laughs) 
And nobody did anything about it, apparently. So now they're saying that people have to be really careful about walking around with your phone in your hand because people can just randomly take it from you. I still see a lot of people doing it though. Yeah, she took out her cell phone just to just to look at her shopping list and people swiped it from her. Like I see a lot of these outdoor streamers. I'm so surprised outdoor streamers don't get their phone swiped more. They all walk around with their chat phone in their hand. That he struck out the side looking. Reading it. Last zero. And when they go to the bathroom to take a bathroom break, they all leave their streaming phone at their dinner table while they go to the bathroom without fear that somebody's going to take it. I mean, I get you don't want to carry your backpack with you into the bathroom. Because that's a lot to carry with you. But at least ask somebody from, like, the table next to you, did I wash your stuff for you or something? Don't just randomly walk away from it. Hoping that it'll be there when you get back. I mean, most people are generous, right? But you never know if somebody's going to take your stuff. Because it could happen to anybody. I think my brownie is like almost done. I think my brownie is almost cool enough. I don't know if you guys want to watch me play Raid Shadow Legends. But let's go cut a piece of brownie, shall we? And go cut a piece of brownie. So be careful, you guys. Don't walk around with your phone in your hand. Especially when you're... And a lot of things I also notice is people walk around with their phone in their hand not... Not paying attention to their surroundings and end up walking into other people. A lot of people do that too. I don't know, you notice that. I think this is cool enough to cut me now. I'm gonna take a drive. I don't know, you guys notice that. You guys want a piece? Want a piece, Mom? Uh, is it cool enough? Yeah, it's cool enough. Right it's a little piece. Let's see if I can get like a little spatula or something.
give my mom this corner piece right here. You got a plate or something? You guys want to try something? Want to try some, Dad? Yes, no. Try some brownies? I thought you'd like brownies. I do. You don't want a piece of this? Again, guys, I use half of the sugar that they asked for in this recipe. Home run. Yeah. They sure hit a lot of home runs against the Giants. Try one piece myself. I should probably put something on here so that my dog doesn't get too late. Put a cover on here. The former Dodger, Alec Wood. Cut myself a piece of brownie and put this over here. Anyway, guys, so I am doing a radio set at 8 o'clock. It's only 5 o'clock right now. From 8 to 10 today. As I do my radio sets on Saturdays from 8 to 10, Fridays from 6 to 8. Should we try the um, try the brownie? You guys, want to try it? Wow, this is good. This is good. You guys like brownies? This is so good. Again, I'm making keto brownies. It is good. Back to back homers. That's why the Dodgers be Dodgers.
Dodgers be Dodgers. That's all I gotta say. I'm not a Dodgers fan, but the Dodgers be Dodgers. We're watching the Giants and Dodgers game, by the way. Freeman, the Freeman. Dodgers are loaded. Dodgers got a rush farm system. It's a Dodger. No matter what their success is in the regular season, they don't have championships to show up to show for. It. Yep. They don't have championships to show for. It, no matter what they're successful, what their success is in the regular season. You would think all the success they have in the regular season, they would have multiple championships, right? Look at how many seasons they've had best record. The last time the Dodgers won the championship was... I think in the 90s. I didn't know. They won one more recent than that. Oh. Kershaw finally won one, didn't he? Kershaw finally won one? What, like three or four seasons ago or something yeah, like that? I think so. But given their success, you would think they would have a record more like the Yankees. But once they get to the playoffs, they're not that good. They're built for the regular season, but they're not built for the playoffs. They had... Well, the Giants were unlucky. They had to play the Dodgers last year in the playoffs in the first round. So. Anyways. Well, yeah, I'm showing you guys uh, a computer stream, a laptop stream without being on the laptop. Without streaming on the laptop, I should say. So, how are you guys doing today? We made some brownies. Damage against left-handed pitcher. 
I'll do raid chat on my game. Yep. He's used in the right situation, meaning matching up playing against left handed pitchers. Is he an everyday guy? No, he's not. He's streaming or not. He's got. So he might ask why I'm. He could be very, very close. Alright, then. Yeah. Check the uh, let me check the battery life for this farm. See if I need to plug the guy in or not. It's currently at 25%. Okay, I'll plug the guy in. Let me plug the guy in. Let's see what we got going. Okay. Shifted to the left side of the infield. See that right side wide open. Do some arena battles. I don't know how far we're going to go. Let's we'll see. There he is. Double play. Anyway, so how are you guys doing? We're currently doing a quote unquote PC stream, but not on a PC. I did not feel like switching computers. <laughs> Upgrade.
Yeah, it looked like a little twinge there. Obviously, we'll see what happens. He kind of nodded his head right now. Just hate to see that. Out of the 3 2, Belt grounds it foul. Posey's retirement belt now the longest tenure giant in his 12th season. Took the qualifying off for the Giants this year last year. At the end of last season after he hit a career high 29 home runs in just 97 games last year. Down swinging. The real space is the minimum thanks to the double play ball. Two nothing Dodgers for the number four. Anyways, uh, let's see what the hell do. What other Saposia can help people with UC achieve and maintain remission, and it's the first and only S1P receptor modulator approved for UC. Don't take Saposia if you've had a heart attack, chest pain, stroke, or mini stroke, heart failure in the last six months, irregular or abnormal heartbeat not corrected by a pacemaker, if you have untreated severe breathing problems during your sleep, or if you take medicines called MAOIs. Symposia may cause serious side effects, including infections that can be life-threatening and cause death, slow heart rate, liver or breathing problems, increased blood pressure, macular edema, and swelling and narrowing of the brain's blood vessels. Okay, wait, so Don't what you guys are doing? Amount, a rare, serious, potentially fatal brain infection cannot be ruled out. Tell your doctor about all your medical conditions. Let's play some more arena. Adams. Use birth control during treatment and for three months after you stop taking Saposia. Don't let UC stop you from doing you. Ask your doctor about one stereo Saposia. Meet Google Pixel 6a, a smarter phone for a smarter price. Powered by the Google Tensor chip. So your camera can see in the dark. The brownie's pretty good, huh? Good. With magic eraser. Photograph all skin tones. It's better with a nut. And last up to 72 hours with extreme. It's not super dry either. Well, it's all you want in a phone. Google Pixel 6a. Switch it up and get the all new Google Pixel 6a. What if you were a gigantic snack food maker and you had to wrestle a massively complex yeah. supply chain to satisfy cravings from Tokyo to Toledo? So you partner with IBM Consulting to bring together data and workflows so that every you guys want some brownie? Can serve up jalapeno, sesame, and chocolate covered goodness with real time data driven precision. Let's create supply chains that have an appetite for performance. IBM, let's create. We changed our fries to make them hot and crispy every single time. High fries. And every single time, Toby insists we high fry. High fry? High fry. High fry. It'll catch up, right? Try Wendy's Hot and Crispy Fries. Prefer almost two to one over McDonald's. <coughs> David Villar has replaced Evan Longoria at third base, and so our suspicions after watching that replay are confirmed. And it's the bummer to have Longoria out of the game with what looks like a lower body injury. Ball on Will Smith. 2 nothing game. Back-to-back -back home runs from Betts and Turner. Do you want a sweeter next time? Again, we've touched on the injury issues the Giants have dealt with this season. Because I only use half the sugar that I asked for. It's fine. It's the way it is. He's on the IL. Tommy Costello has been hurt a lot of the year. Currently on the COVID IL. And Smith plays on the corner. That one scoops by Gonzalez. And he's got a leadoff double. Second time through the lineup right now, and three of the four hitters reached on base. Two home runs, a double, and the other one's a line out to the second baseman, Freddie Freeman. It's a strike on Hanser Alberto. For more on Evan Longoria, here's Kenny. Well, Joe, he has made six trips to the injured Let's list. Let's see how far we can go. I can knock those, show you guys, like, the different streamers that I watch. And when you're not healthy, it becomes increasingly difficult. He could face an interesting decision. And may or may not be on today. Giants hold a $13 million option on him. If they don't pick it up, they have to buy him out for $5 million. So it's an $8 million decision for the Giants. 
if they pick up the option and Longoria is healthy, yes, he would like to return for his age 37 campaign. But if they decline it and send him to free agency, he's going to think twice about whether he's going to be his career. It's on campaign. I mean, do some campaign. Yeah. 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 My dog's sleeping over there. Body doesn't recover like it once used to. Let's see if it came yet. So I'm looking for deliveries today. Struck out looking his first time on a five consecutive Okay, let me go outside. I'm from the. Let me go outside and get my mail. You stay. Day, Superboy. Uh, 
See, I always have a drum keys with me. show you guys what I'm working on. the uh, the hex bows that came with it so I decided to get some drum tuning bows which are probably better than the hex bows that came with it because it was like eight dollars for 20 of these If I can open this, let's see if one hex will work first. I think the hex bolts might work better. For 20 of them, it was like $8, so... And I can... I can give her a drum key. Because... The drum key... I have... A lot of drum keys. Mm-hmm. 
Just turn it this way. I'm turning a drum. I have multiple drum keys, so it's no big deal for me. To give her one of my drum keys, cause I have a drum. I am a drummer, and I don't need this many drum keys. I know you have seen drum boats like this before. A different kind of um, drum keys that people can buy. I'm currently tuning a this is a doom back. Well, it's supposed to be a doom back anyways. Supposed to be a doom bag. Which is all. It's supposed to be a doom bag. These have washers in them, which are better, much better than the hex ones that don't have washers. Besides, I think this is a much better tuning system than the hex. Switch out the metal washers for um, for um, these are all rusted, anyways. So I suggest that people switch out the metal washers for for. Um,
What do they call them? Rubber? Rubber washer? Or for like rubber foam washer just These are better. But it's up to you. Cause the metal, cause the foam washers allow you to tune it more. I think this is a better tuning system. At least I do anyway. I got this is a much better tuning system. Then you then the hex system and it has washers in it which is much better so I don't know if I should I'm doing some of these That is more even. So that is more even. I always want to make when you remember when you're tuning. I always want it to be more even. Well, it's even and possible. So what I can do is, um, Look this again. Maybe it's harder to tune because it dried. I don't know. But I could soak this again. She's not coming for like another week or so anyway. It's a better tuning than the hex. Yeah. 
I just let her know that I changed it out. Anyways. Mm. I might have to, um, soak it. Soak it again. This is perfectly fine. So what I will do is I will take this off. And I got re again. And a much better tuning system than Hex. I'm a drummer, so I should know. It's off and then restock the skin. Anyway, so how are you guys doing? Um, they currently taking these off. So you see these compared to these, these are a little bit longer, but these, these are the old hex ones. These are better. Bought a bunch of them, 20 of them. For like ten bucks. This is a drum one. Let's see if I if I clamp this down more. I'm gonna um, make this more even. 
I want it to be as even as possible. That's what I want. You never want it to be uneven. So what I did was I loosened it. You always wanted, you always want the tension to be as even as possible. I gotta cut it anyway. I always want the tension to be as even as possible. If you can. But let me let me take this off so I can restock it. So that the skin is evenly tensioned. A better tuning mechanism. I'd rather like if this were my own, I probably would have changed it out anyways. Yeah, they have different kinds of drum keys. I got re um We soaked, we soaked the head anyway. We were pretty cheap for these.
Let's see what happens if I try to if I try the uh See I helped her buy a a pre-manufactured head. But she said she couldn't get it on here. I can try it. But she's not coming anyway, so... She, I mean, she's not coming for a week anyway, so... Much better stream. I'll see if I can try the pre-manufactured head. She said she wasn't able to get it on. I'll try to do it myself. See if I can get it on. This is my work. This is what I do besides walking dogs. I fix people's drums. I got to bring these down too. I'll leave this here for now. I mean, can we get the pre-manufactured drum here and see if I can get it on here? Super boy, you're a good boy. Um, yeah, I'll drink it later, though. Let's see if I can get the pre-manufactured head to, to fit on here. This is what I do, you guys. I fix people's drums. When I'm not when I'm not walking no let's see this fit.
I think this will work. Let me see if I can get this going. I see this work. I see this work.
don't know. I'm trying to see if this will work. I'm trying to see if I can somehow get this to fit in here. If I can't, I can't.
I think we can get this to fit. I'm trying to see if I can get this. This is Let's see if I can get something just longer.
That's the way it's supposed to be. I think I have, let me see if I have longer ones. I think I have longer ones in my room. Let me see. I think I have longer ones in my room. I just want to get longer ones so I can kind of put that. It's made to stretch like that.
guys, let's see if I, I can get. The uh, yeah, I can find longer. I know I have longer ones like that. Um, See if I can find. Sorry, my guess. Sorry, guys. My room is kind of messy right now. I'm looking for. Looking for. I know I have longer ones. I'll just take one of them off. I'll just take one of them off of here. I just take one of them off. Doesn't matter. I just take one of them off. Sorry about that. I just took one of them off. I am a drummer. Let's see if this will work. See if this will work, this will work. I just
You don't have to be stupid. You don't want it to pop per se. I think we see him. Take this saw. Oh, that's the plastic washer. Okay. Let's see if this works. I got multiples of these.
Yeah, I know this works in that.
trying to
Sounds good to me. I was able to do that. Oh, nah. Cool. Tell the plastic one. That's a nice walk, 3,000. I suggest people get at least 10,000 steps a day if they can. So let's see, I will take a picture this way. So how are you guys doing? Um Okay. Sharks hunt along this coast. Their 5,700 mile journey around the Atlantic is one of the longest of any marine animal. But there's another dangerous present in these waters. Find 
new answers, find new roads. Chevrolet. My active psoriatic arthritis can slow me down. Now, the Sky Rizzi helps me get going by treating my skin with joints. Glow with significantly clearer skin. Sky Rizzi helps me move with less joint pain, stiffness, swelling, and fatigue. And Sky Rizzi is just four doses a year after two starter doses. Sky Rizzi attaches to and reduces a source of excess inflammation that can lead to skin and joint symptoms. With Sky Rizzi, 90% clearer skin and less joint pain is possible. No thanks. Serious allergic reactions and an increased risk of infections or a lower ability to fight them may occur. Tell your doctor if you have an infection or symptoms, have a vaccine, or plan to. With Scarizzi, there's nothing like the feeling of improving my skin and joints. And that means every day. Now's the time to talk to your doctor about how Scarizzi can help treat your psoriatic arthritis so you can get going. Learn how happy he can help you save. Dinner or what? Yeah, I am. I'm going to start in a few minutes. You're going to start? Yeah. Because I already got a marinator. I think I'll be cooking. Yep. Look at that. What are they trailing by? It was four nothing when I last looked. It's four to two. Top of the nine. Are they still batting? Yeah, but two outs. Oh. Uh, do we want to watch it? Okay. What? No, I'm okay. No orange for me. Four to two. Better tuning bugs and what we do. Double single walk for Slater in this game. Time on the board. Go ahead and run at the plate. One ball, one strike. Huh. Giants raised a 5 0 lead late in the first game of this series. Hey guys, well, let me uh, take this off of here. finish putting on a head I showed myself putting on a head for um, a drum a zoom back head 
for a drum that I get fixed for somebody that's coming in a week or we're gonna drive that's gonna pick it up in a week so but I think that's gonna be the end of today's stream thank you guys for watching I hope you enjoyed um I hope you enjoyed me big enjoyed watching me um bake some keto brownies and enjoyed me um showing you how I replaced the head on the drum I will see you guys next time this is the positive panda remember to always be strong be healthy be bulletproof but most of all be positive I will see you guys Bye. Um, hey, let me raid my friend first. It transmits a radio signal which can be picked up by a network of underwater receivers. Let me. I'm gonna raid my friend. Because she's done. And teach them about their migration patterns. Antes cuando lo sacaba, eh, era el mejor momento de I will see you guys on the next stream. Bye bye. I will see you later. Bye. Bye. Oh.